Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of the Fragrance Specialist. Today I'll be reviewing a fragrance from the house of Yves Saint Laurent and that is L'Homme Sport. I'm delighted to be the first reviewer to actually own the bottle. So, next up we have the presentation for L'Homme Sport by Yves Saint Laurent. Alright everyone. This is the presentation for Lom Sport. As you can see, this is the box right here. You have the YSL logo here with that pentagon shape around it. Lom Sport by Yves Saint Laurent, 3.4 ounce to toilet. The bottom you have the batch code engraved in there, as you can see. At the top you have the same logo, repeated again. Nothing going on the side. The back you have uh, under barcode right here some information on the ingredients and uh, other relative information. Other barcode on the sides. As far as the bottle, you have Long Sport written here by you Saint Laurent. At the bottom you're gonna find the sticker with the size, relative information. It's the 3.4 ounce at the top. Very nice uh, cap, it has the YSL logo engraved in there. And uh, another tip for you guys, the, the lid for this bottle is uh, quite different from the other loam bottles. Like the original loam would have uh, a metallic cap, it has a metallic finish to it. But uh, this one is mate, it's not metallic, it's mate actually. Very nice touch. Comes out the cap very easily and the best thing about this bottle is the tube for the sprayer it's actually red very nice professional look to it well done and uh, that's it guys this is the presentation for long sport next up we have the smell alright everyone before I dissect the smell for Long Sport by Yves Saint Laurent, let me give you just some information on the fragrance itself. So, it was released in 2014, so just last year. The perfumer for this fragrance is Annie Filippo and associated with Juliet Carugozu Glow. Alright, so, moving on to the smell. So, at the top we have Bergamot, Aldehyde, Verbena. Mid notes we have woody notes, coriander, and in the base we have amber and cedarwood. So, what do you get from Long Sport? So, right at the top, you will definitely notice all three ingredients, which are bergamot, aldehydes, and verbena. All of them are very prominent. All of them, especially the aldehydes. So, let me tell you guys what is aldehydes. So, of course, this is from the internet. So, it is an organic compound containing the group of CHO formed by oxidize, oxidize, oxidation sorry, of alcohols. So, this is exactly what you get from this fragrance. It's not very natural smelling. Even though there is bergamot or verbena, it's, not, it's very chemically. And don't get me wrong, it's not synthetic. The fragrance is not synthetic, but it's very chemically. Like it's not natural smelling at all. However, that's the good thing about this fragrance that uh, because of that, as the name implies, it's a sport fragrance. Sport fragrances are always known for the being uh, different, and uh, they're just based on chemicals. The fragrance itself, like for example, Chanel Alarm Sport. It's a bit uh, natural smelling than long sport, but still it has the sport DNA. All sports, uh, all the fragrances that contain the word sport in them, has the same DNA, and you, you should expect the same smell from any fragrance that has the word sport in it. Okay, so let's move on to the mid. For the mid, you have woodsy notes and coriander. You definitely kept the coriander, but the woodsy notes. Slight, you're gonna get slight woody, woody notes in there. Like it's not very prominent in this fragrance. 
I know that a lot of people may say that there is some woods in there, but I really don't get the woods at all. I get just the top notes for this fragrance. And the top notes for this fragrance last a long time. We're talking about three, three to four hours. Yeah, that's a lot, guys. Anyways, moving on to the base notes. You have amber and cedar. Now, you will not get amber at all. I honestly have no idea why people in include amber in sports fragrances. And sometimes I've seen amber being placed in uh, other summer scents. I don't know how honestly they should include amber. And you, all, uh, you guys know that amber is the fantasy note in perfumery, in the modern perfumery. As you know, like the real amber has been uh, extinct with that dinosaur. So, anyways. So, the fragrance itself is a very useful, but the best thing about this fragrance is that uh, it's professional. As you can uh, see from the presentation earlier, it has a very professional look to it. Like honestly, whenever I'm dressed formally and I want to smell, smell fresh and clean, I wear this fragrance. I always reach for this fragrance. But bear in mind, when I say fresh and clean, I'm not talking about being soapy. It's not very soapy. It's not soapy at all. It's just fresh, clean. Like uh, the type when you shave, I just want a fresh scent to put on. This is exactly what I get. Uh, this is the vibe that I get from Long Sport. And uh, it's very versatile the scent. I will uh, mention this guy uh, to you guys in the rating system. But this is a very versatile scent. Honestly, I wear it during the day, during the night, in the afternoon. Uh, if I need to go somewhere that's not very like special or uh, it's not even an event, I just want to go get the, the groceries or anything. It's not like uh, an upscale event. Uh, event scent. You can actually wear it in an uh, upscale event, but uh, I'm sure if you have a collection, you can reach out for another fragrance. So, this is the smell for you guys. Next up, we have the rating. Alright, everyone, let's rate Long Sport by Yves Laurent. So, longevity. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Expect from 4 to 7 hours. I know a lot of people complain about the longevity for this fragrance, but I do get long, good longevity. Projection. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10 as well. It uh, ra radiates within an arm length, which is good for a uh, sporty fragrance, because uh, you know, sport fragrances uh, tend to fade away really quick at the initial spray, like 10 minutes, uh, 15 minutes and it's gone. But with this fragrance, actually, it's good projection. In terms of versatility, this is a very versatile scent. You can wear it during the day, during the night, even in the afternoon. Anyway, just any time of the day, anywhere. And I, as I mentioned earlier, this is a very professional scent. So if you want to smell fresh and clean while wearing a suit, this is the fragrance for you. In terms of uh, presentation, 10 out of 10. I love the presentation, Spe especially with the red the tube for the sprayer. Very nice touch. It gives you this sporty vibe. It just gives you this atmosphere of being sporty and being an athlete. Very nice presentation for long sport. So, overall smell, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. As I mentioned, this is not uh, a very natural smelling uh, cologne, but uh, it does the job for me and I really like it. So, I'm going to give uh, long sport by Yves Saint Laurent an over overall score of. 8 out of 10. Thanks for watching.